anthem, you can feel like that the fans is not gonna let us win this one tonight. Yes, I mean, I mean, what place is, I mean Boston. Boston, yeah. Why, why do you why do you hate Boston? Cause they racist as fuck. That's they, why. They, well, I'm pretty sure LeBron is going to find himself under fire for this comment, but at the end of the day, he verified what several black athletes have said about this particular city, which is the city of Boston. LeBron James, as you heard him say from an episode of The Shop, that Boston is racist. Um, We know the historic history of Boston, this is a city that gladly embraced their racism. Keep in mind, uh, a few years ago, they were calling a black hockey player the N-word. So this comes to no surprise. Barry Bonds said he would have never played in the city of Boston. Um, when Jim Rice played there, if he would make an error, they said they would call him the N-word. So this comes to no surprise. One of the reasons why I really wanted the Warriors to beat the Boston Celtics is because of how Bill Russell was treated. Bill Russell didn't come back to that city for years. Yeah, he played. He won championships there. But at the same time, he still went through a lot of racism. And like I said, this city has historically embraced and endorsed their racism. And, you know, I went back and forth with people from Boston, say, hey, I'm from Boston, I'm white, and not everybody from Boston is racist. Nah, about, you're right, probably about 95% of y'all, like I said, I know people from Boston who are black and said that that city was racist. I know white people who came from Boston and said that that city was racist. White people said that city was racist. Okay? So I'm not trying to hear it. You know, LeBron James, I give him credit. Outside of basketball, he speaks on stuff that a lot of basketball players or athletes in general are scared to touch. So I give him credit for this. Now, as far as him, the basketball player, you know, some of the, you know, him historically... That's a different conversation. But outside of basketball, I'm glad LeBron James has opened up these type of subjects and discussed these type of subjects. And he's being himself. I give him credit for LeBron James not always being politically correct, saying what's on his mind at the time, whether some people find it wrong or whether some people commend him for it. So I give him credit for this. But I give him credit for verifying what a lot of people have said you know that the city of boston is racist so you know hey it is what it is man so you heard that come straight out of lebron james mouth one of the most popular athletes in the world this your boy town biz i'm out